Dragon? Fold your paper hot dog style, the long way. So, the dragon way? Sure. Long. Oh, yes, long in Chinese means dragon. Okay. Oh, that. So, you're going to cut, but don't cut all the way through. Now, stop there, Ethan. Yep. You got that more thin? Yeah, that or, yeah, you can do however you want. You can do little designs, a little kind of wavy if you want, or Shane. Okay, so my you got brother, them all that way. My brother That's kind okay. I've got the idea. Okay, so you kind of take it like that. Okay. Take the ends my and match them together. My brother made it a little bit too thin. And so I it may, gonna, may rip. Yes, but yeah. I was actually going to give up mine to give to him, and I would actually use a different color. Shane didn't want me to do it. Okay, then you're going to take a little bit of a glue stick and glue that part together. Why is mine very thin? Because you made really thin lines, so it's really cool. But shouldn't it be really Hold on. fat? Now push it together like that, yeah. You can adjust it. Hold on, I want more bin. Okay, here's your glue stick. It's not working. Only the people that actually know how to use glue can actually use Gotta glue. Be smarter than the glue stick. Stop. And when do I try to I hate this type of glue. I know. But you can hold it on there. What I want to do is make another slit. Yeah, you can, very carefully. Start it, and then you can cut it a little bit further. Oh, wait, hold on. There we go. And if you want this, you can actually do this if you want it, to make it even yes, all the way. It's sticky. You have to hold on to it for a little bit. Boing! <laughs> Boing! Boing! If you're wondering, this is how springs are made, but just with steel. This is actually how most springs are made. Like, if this is Samurai, yeah. Anna, please tell me where to get it because, like, see, it adds enough armor that it's going to be pretty hard to get in between these, especially if you actually have plates. Big, big steel plates right here, and look, I can move this perfectly. It may be, be a little bit harder with steel, but landing. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! A boink. <laughs> landing. I love that so much. You've got an idea. Do I have an idea? Oh no! Ethan's got an idea. I know it's a good one. Quiet, Shane. I have to make it perfect. My line isn't even Just perfect. Just a little pretty. It's, none of it's supposed to be perfect. This whole thing's not supposed to be perfect. I'm going 
going a little bit fancier than all you guys need to do. Okay, so um, I will be done in a little bit minutes. In a little bit, a little bit. Of, no, mom, at the very end. If you're wondering how I made these, all you do is just take a piece of paper. Wait. It's even difficult for me to make. You might think, that's not difficult. Well, it actually is somewhat difficult. Be careful with the staplers. Be careful. And just add a little bit of glue. If your stapler fit, if you make a whole lot bigger one of these, your stapler might fit in this little hole and then you can just staple it. But our stapler doesn't fit, which I should say is my Aunt Sherry stapler. This is what I've made. It's pretty, it actually has a bottom. Here's the thing. What my mom was trying to make us. That's just and, a basic one. And what I made. I think I upped it up quite a bit. Yep. You don't know what things I used to make when I was your age. Do do. I used to do like you. Do do. Butterfly. Oh! <laughs> it landed. <laughs> Hold on, try it one more time. Butterfly. Dang it. Butterfly. Lantern flip. Lantern flip. Lantern flip. I like it because it was whoop, whoop, whoop. Doing, doing, doing. Wait! Hold on. Hold on. It's a drum. Nope, it's not a drum. Actually, technically, we could use this as a drum. Hold on. Real quick, widen this up. No wonder it's not doing like it's supposed to be. Okay, now look, it's a drum. This isn't one of those um, lanterns that you take it and you float it up in the air um, like this balloon. You don't take it and float it up in the air. You can with the balloon, a balloon, but you don't take a candle. You don't just <laughs> plop a candle in there and light it and it floats up in the air. Oh, you, don't use a, you don't use a candle with this at all. It's just decorative. You, it would all, catch on fire. Literally all you do is put a little hanger like that and you just hang it up like that. It's decently cool, actually. I like it. Bye, everybody.